this is a very good practice because lots of shots off these five reds. It looks easy, but it's, it's, this is tough. This is very, very tough. Keep on doing it. Stay here, scoring quick. 
you're scoring quick, you're not moving far, and you, you, you're in control of the table. When you start running the ball off cushions, you've got to then get the pace right. But this, this, is, uh, this is very hard as well. Um, but again, when you, when you can do the five reds going to pass the blue, that will improve a player 20 or 30 points scoring. Um, and when you can do seven, that you'll be, you know, a good player, a really good, strong player. Because, it, you know, until you try it, until you try it, it, it's very tough. But this one is, the three reds there is, is control of the black. And that's where you score. Same as the blue. That's where you, you control him to come back down this part of the table and score again. As soon as you start leaving yourself shots like this, in here, anywhere, anywhere here, just off straight, this whole, this game over, you're going to break down. You're waiting to break down. But here, you can come back down and score. But just, not just off straight, I mean, to get that round there, I mean, that takes some doing. Um, and you trust him to luck on where the white is going to end up for your next position shot. But like I said, go on, that five red, screw it past the blue. That will improve your 20, 30 points in break building. Uh, maybe, maybe more than that. Um, and it's, it's good because it's a good, you are, you are literally queuing the ball the same every time. And it does help when you're playing on the table as quick as this. Um, you have to just, well, yeah, I'm just going to explain to you about the screw shot. It's not about how hard you hit the ball, it's about how well you hit the ball. And uh, basically, as, you, as you're setting yourself up for this shot, you come down on line, nice and loose, nice and loose backhand. Sort of comfortable where, you, where you're looking to strike. Bring back nice and slow. Push through. You can't get that by hitting it hard because uh, you're not getting the bite on the white. You know, if you, if you look at what I'm going to do now, it's hitting hard. There's no control there. It's going back to come back because it's so this table is so quick, reactive. Get that right, actually. But um, you want to be you want to be in control of every shot that you play it. So you know where the white's going. So the next shot becomes easier. Following on to the next shot becomes easier. Everyone's in range. So that's it, really. Yeah. So uh, you demonstrate we have good and bad shots for us. Like uh, uh, you've got a you know white ball for the table and hit the ball and back back down the water. Got you all here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's going to be hard for me to do that. I've not played that for a while. <laughs> Go on, Bob, it's your turn, son, isn't it? Go <laughs> on, show him one, Bob. Show him a new screw. Yeah, no, 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 this table can do it. Yeah, you can. Really fast, isn't it? Yeah, this is... But tell them how, like, what's the how to do it. Yeah. Yeah. The, secret, the secret of playing of this shot is, is keeping a spin on the white ball. So it's not, again, it's not how hard you hit this ball. It's about how much spin you get on the ball. So I, I, would, I would be playing this sort of low, low down. But when I finish, when I finish, my key will be straight through to there. That then creates a spin, so the ball is spinning all the way down the table until it gets to here, until it makes contact, and it's still got the spin on it. So the spin then is a little bit bad. Well, the delivery is about slow, smooth back, and long with power going through. Um, yeah, it's not about how hard you hit it, um, because the harder you hit it... You know, what I meant to you from earlier, Chip, was to keep it... Because I have to do it, how to do it before. You should have sung, you should have done it, you've got to keep 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 it, you've got yeah, you've got to, so, so when I'm queuing here, when I finish, look where the queue is. The queue's finished over there. You have to get through the ball. It's not about how hard you hit it, it's about going through. This is a gauge there, you've got it. 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 You've got it.
。如果你拉到啲咁多有啲人唔識嘅咧，就就冇扯後啦。你睇佢拉完個個嘅 Q 去到邊咧？全部俾到依個嗰個機管發現啲乜乜，佢知 Q 一定拉到手指公啦，係啦。你記得手指公為標準咧，打呢樣波咧，你就有你就有機會。你唔識拉到手指公嘅咧，你打幾多波？係冇可能，因為你 Q 數量夠多嘛。但係要送得到曬出去先得。我哋拉到手指公，你一定送曬。因為你知 Q 一定要，因為冇得再欠，你一定要放下出嚟。你試一試，唔係我唔試啦。你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你你He said he wants to drop his shoulder. Huh? Yeah. He said he wants to do Ronnie drop his shoulder. Yeah. Do you know what that's what Ronnie does? Yeah. That's what Ronnie does. But he said he doesn't want to do that. Though, no, it's that's that's uh, yeah. Ronnie's an exception. Yeah, my uh, also that's an exception. The deep ball, then, just he can do it. You know, the whole ball. If you feel he wants to do the deep ball, you don't have to do it. Again, this, 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 uh, what we say, uh, when you've got a very light cue, this shot is very hard to play because you're actually trying to get the spin on the ball and keep the spin on the ball. So when the ball's going down the table, it's spinning, and then when it hits the ball, it, it comes back. TQ, you're heading and with a lighter Q, it doesn't get lighter than the ball. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. But this is the one that you can't see. 同支草藥咧有關係嘅，佢嗰支誒，佢、呃、以前打嗰支尾部嗰啲風力咧，亦都有重量，亦都有唔正常重量嘅，接近二十嘅，所以佢哋起嗰啲轉咧，你哋攞正常嘅 Q 咧，係冇可能遇到嘅，所以唔好問點解，都冇人同我講。你買支 Q 有廿有去到重誒、呃、十九至十廿斤，你就有機會做到啲嘢啦。你支 Q 係正常，好似我哋咁嘅，加誒十七點五啊、十八點五嘅，你唔使諗，嗰啲轉係唔起唔到。所以你明白就係有時冇俾人夾到。哦。O K， 有冇啲咩有有冇啲咩問題想問啊？有冇啲咩諗到啲咩問題想問啊？有冇啲問題？所以佢講啲。阿波比有冇啲咩通常啲人會有興趣知嘅問題咧？日日翻去波兩年咩咯？係，咁頭先我都示範咗少少。Actually， 誒，想 ask 誒，係係你，即係，係誒，佢 hit the shot， 佢 shot 嘅，佢 shot 嘅，我哋我哋嘅 form difference between when you use it for long play， is there any form difference？ No， it's for being controlled. You've got to be controlled. So the the key to the key to it is is hitting the white ball, striking the white ball the same. Every time, so you strike the white different. Same here, 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 here. here. With the hand, nice and loose. Q. Don't be tight. Too you tight, wrist. No, no room there. So you've got to be nice and loose. And you go through. That's where the power is. That's where the power is. That's where uh, the timing comes from. And obviously, where you get the spin on. But you know, this, that's this is where the five shots. Come in, uh, where you have to de deliver the cue the same all the time for every shot, and it does make things work. Whatever you're on, your speed, um, and everything else will come into it. Well, the double kiss, straight. The double kiss is good. So you hit the, you hit the white ball. Chop. It's not in the same line. 你要識睇同埋你個方仔咧就唔好。Just off, just off. Well, there's two ways to play. 
Two in one that shot is cool. If you hit it well, it goes in. If you hit it a little bit thinner, then it comes to the cushion and goes to the cushion. Leaves over there. Uh, to play it any slower, I mean, if you're, if you're playing well, seeing well, the thin cut is good. But the last ball, if you miss the shot, it's frame over. So the, fit, the thin clip either side. It's a tough shot. This is one of the toughest shots. I'm glad you put it up. I mean, I, I like, I would probably, I would probably play a little bit of right hand side and play for the right hand side of the red to get the black to go over here and the white to come over. No, no, white to come back. Play it nice and slow and controlled, but it's tough. Very tough. But the key to it is, that's obviously a tough shot left, but the key to it is, is keep the black safe. You know, the black can be anywhere, the white can be anywhere, sorry. As long as you've got the black buried on the cushion, and you're not leaving a chance. But the key, the, the, the toughest shot here, if, you, if you're playing a black situation, the best possible shot is to leave them like that. If you leave them like that and we've walked you back, what do you play in? Yeah, this is a tough shot. You've got to play flicking off. You've got to flick off like that. But to get that right is, is hard because you get a double kiss. And uh, in different places down the cushion. So if you were to play that, if you leave them this, then you, 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 won, you should win, have an opportunity to win the frame. Because this, again, this is a very thin shot. That's it. You've got to be that thin. It's not bad, is it? Yeah, yeah Steve. Yeah. I want to know how you step into the line of shot. I'll show you briefly. Or a rough guy. Yeah, like a black with spots or not. Yeah. Real spot. You'll see that. Take it off. Same side of that. You'll get angled. Show how you will feel step into line. See the shot, step in line. Yeah, well you, the, the key to the shot is when you short the cue behind, you see the angle, you now put the chalk away, now you know what you're gonna where you're gonna position them, put on the whiteboard for your next position of shot. So you, you, when you stand behind the shot here, you see the angle, what you wanna what where you wanna strike the whiteboard for your positional shot. And then as you stand, as you as you're behind the shot, you literally put your foot, your right foot, if you're right-handed, left foot if you're left-handed, on the line of the shot. Because there's no point standing over here and trying to lean back over here. You've got to put your foot on the line of the shot and then walk in with the cue over, and the cue will end up over the back leg. And then as you can sit down, you're down on the shot, ready to go. But the key to, the, the key to it is a bit of chalk, to be fair, because, you know, over the years, the, when you are looking at the game, playing shots, it's all about chalking the cue, looking at what you're going to do, and then go and do it. Um, I never realised this as a kid. You know, chalk, just walk in. But you have to, you have to try and make every shot individual. Um, if you if you're flowing and you're around the black spot, and you can see the pattern, the pattern's opened up for you: red, black, red, black, red, pink, and the reds are open. Then that's fine. But you still have to chalk the cue make every shot individual walk down and sit down on the shot properly. Like I said, you can't find, you can't get down the shot and then look for the angle. Because the angles, you're, you're down on the shot there, you've got to see the angle stood here. And then you obviously, when you're deciding what angle, what angle you're going to play, obviously you've got to tell the white or what to do. And that is obviously the key to the game is to tell the white what to do. What to, what to do.
Don't. No, it's tough. <laughs> Don't. 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 Now I'm, I'm aiming to miss that rep. I'm aiming to the left hand side. The left hand side is going to go like that. It's going to go like that. You won't see it, but you have to allow for it. So the right hand side, I'll be aiming over here for the ball to come in and spin. And over a short distance, it's very tricky because tips, tubes, cloths, balls. All throw differently. And like you see tonight, I missed a lot in the first few frames where I'm getting used to the table, how fast the bed is, and it takes a bit of a The side is it's about the best way to explain side, don't play too much of it. Play play uh, if I show you, just play little little bits around the white wall around here. Just little bits because to play masses aside over here, you've got a chance of miscuing. And it's very hard to allow, especially on these fast tables, because uh, the ball bends on you and um, moves on you very quickly. So it's a matter of uh, playing. Practice this with lots of sides, and then you'll see how hard it is. Playing this with, I'm going to play this with lots of right hand side now. So, so it's missable. And that shows you how hard it is to play with masses of side. But left, just, just play cut the left hand once. Right hand But that's, that's the best shot to feel on it really, get everything else is very tricky. Very tricky. Yeah, but sometimes when you pay a side, you uh, push it like maybe on the right hand side. Yep. Yeah. On the right hand side, the ball will push it to the left hand. Yeah. For some, for, for some cue, but sometimes when I do it, actually the ball is not pushing on the left hand, or to the left, but actually to the right. You know, um, what do you mean by that? Mm -hmm. Say if I, along this line, yeah. Say if I push it on the right side, right hand side. Let's not push it this way. You see that? No. That is what, that's what I mean. Is that, is that because my queuing action is not correct? You know, so theoretically, on the right hand side, the ball is pushing on this way. Is that? Sorry. Do that again. Theoretically, but we push on the right hand side. Like, like that. The ball is pushing this way. Supposedly it's pushing this way. Yeah. By the book. Yeah. You know? But actually it's not the case. For me. Probably for me. If you're nice and loose, if you watch me, look, if you watch me, I can play this shot left hand side, and it goes like that. It's how you get the spin on. There's a difference here. If you watch my hand here, I'm going to squeeze. Right? So now I'm going to get the spin on. It goes left. I'm squeezing, and the squeeze gets more spin off. It makes it. So you can't be taller, you just will be pinned. Ah, you pinned the game. You can't be taller, you just will be three seconds long. Yeah, because the game is on for you. So you just want to play it down to your ball. You just have to play nice and nice and loose here, nice and loose. I'm doing all my, all my. I'm playing like that. If you hit it any hard, more deliberate. If you hit it with. Authority. If you really hit yeah, it, yeah, yeah. really hit it, then then the ball will go off the line. Uh, just be nice and controlled. Again, this is where this 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 helps. You know, when you when you're playing this these these reds here, and you're queuing back, set yourself up first one, and you want to play screw back left hand side. So when it when you play left hand side of the ball, it drags. 
so you can hit it a bit firmer and come past the blue. I want to show you. Is he like his normal? No, right hand side. You get it firmer, you see it slow up? It slows up. So again, this is uh, a good Q and action, a good Q and exercise. That on the other side on. Play that shot again, see if it speeds up. Just wanted to see if it speeds any good. Yeah, it's alright. Yeah. Normal. Big Q with it, why don't you make it take a second? Practice that. The only key idea for that is to practice this one. The only one, the one that the one the the one that the the Means you can be more deliberate and then more controlled. Yeah, that's nice. It's got a nice tip on it. And this one. Just want to confirm it's not my sort. I've never heard of it. The 18 moment that I've taken so far. Okay. That's the wrong thing to be fair. You are? Just leave it uh, they're asking for the open pad. How do you screw back and then make sure that all the blue red balls prepare apart? That's good. That's a good pad. Well, you can't guarantee it. <laughs> <laughs> you can't guarantee it. You've got to give yourself a chance. So, say there's uh, six reds here, yeah? You've got to look to where you want to go in. I mean, I would, I would instantly see that one there, knocking that one, that one going that. That one go over there, this one go over here. Screw back into them and come by this side, that's hard because again, what, how you've got to do this is when you're queuing the ball, so when you're queuing the ball, is uh, down the shot here, when you're queuing it here, you come back nice and slow, and then when you go forward, forward you've got to have the squeeze on the cue now, squeeze, 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 squeeze all the way through. That then keeps the spin on. Pops the black, keeps the spin on, it comes through. Yeah, Ronnie's, Ronnie, and there's a few players who play this, but Ronnie's, um, he, he developed this shot. And, uh, you know, you, you can stun into them and you stick, hit the black well, you stick in them, you can stick there. You've just got to look to see what's going to come out. So, it's a puzzle, really. So, if you if you hit the end red, you just re cube. When you're here, just see what happens. See what happens. So you see there's the two reds. I said that one's going to go over there. The two reds are open. You have to look into what, yeah, it's not luck. A little bit of luck, but more how do you see what's going to open. I like to play the shot slow. Because um, if, you, if you clip them, if you clip them and they get the white goes down there, then you've opened all the frame up and now you've got a tough shot. But you've got to play the shot really, is to hit as much of something as you can to give yourself a chance for it to move. So with that, again, it's all technique. Again, when you can do the five reds across, that will help your technique to go through. But you know, it's, uh, you can hit this shot nine times out of 10 and get something. But the one, the one time you feel like you've hit it well, you don't get it. So I'm already asking about if you put it on the side, and then, yeah. No, you just got to make sure you make good contact on the white. I mean, it's the side the side shot is, yeah, you can spin off, hit the pack of reds, come to the cushion and spin off, so the reds are opened, and you're still down this block of table. But that's very tough. Yeah. That's, uh, What's wrong with that?
that's um, you know for the top rate score people right? um, but it's there to learn and that's I mean it's a good practice it's a good practice to stick six or seven minutes up and to compare the black to see what happens but you have to experience everything you can't just say well I'm going to hit the third you have to see experience lots of playing to actually get it to work I see what's going on. 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 I see what